That looks pretty cool. What are you? Uh... Oh fuck! <laughs> what are you doing? Doing a little, little, little sword training. Oh. Yeah, I wasn't link. sure if you were trying to like kill them or something. No. Test dummy, man. Test oh, okay. Dummy. Okay. Gotcha. A little link. <laughs> <laughs> JK, just set, set him back up. It back up, sorry. I know you're transgender-ish, awkward eagle, trans animal too. <laughs> you filming? Yeah. Oh. How was your night, man? It was great. Wow. Usually I, I ask and you're like, oh, it's good. But, oh, because you, you didn't fucking stay here. You didn't have to sleep here, so <laughs> your house it's is great. great. <laughs> you're one of the reasons why I do this. Come on, you want to switch? Do I get like a stick Slice or something? Slice your fucking corn cob off and I'll add it to the pile out there. But what if I use like that stick right there? For what? Then we can like spar. Hey, you want to go, bro? You realize I'll cut right through that shit, right? <laughs> this thing's pretty sharp. Trust me, I figured it out. I'm gonna train out here for a while. Apparently there's nothing better to do. Get a little proficient. I'm trying to get good with my left hand as well. Watch some YouTube videos. What little fucking service and internet I have out here. But uh, pretty sick. Actually, here. You want to see something really cool? Of course. Right there, right here. Uh, believe it or not, I had some other little devices in the, my sword holder. Check that shit out. Oh. I have another one. Might follow my pocket while I was getting excited. But I'll show you. I think they're like these little throwing johns. I forget what the name of these yeah. are. Yeah. a better angle here. Oh. It's hard nice. to get them to stick into yeah. that drywall. Yeah, I've thrown them before. But, they're yeah. tough. When it does, it's sick. I feel bad though, I want to ruin Damien's face. Yeah. So I was thinking, um, oh, since you're filming. Hey there, Jay, Zero Pound Majorians here. Imagine I just cut my ponytail off. <laughs> um, we need to move it. For, like, the why? RV, we need to get it the fuck out of here. Why? Because of all, all yesterday. Brian? Uh, no, I just. I mean, come on, dude. I wasn't the only one. The dude was fucking oh, weird. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's definitely weird. Like, like fishy. Yeah. Weird. Because um, I was thinking about it, dude. More and more. Like, where, where does he go? Is he? Did he really just fly out from California just to talk to me? Just for, like, what would look to be, like, just a standard, like, DSLR camera. Mm -hmm. He didn't seem real professional about it. His questions were awkward. He was awkward. He was. You'd think, you know, he's like, uh... This professional type, you know, he'd have like a clipboard with questions and all this stuff. Maybe have a whole crew for documentary. So I don't know, guys. He stayed. How late did he stay till? What was it like eight, nine? Oh, yeah, I'd say definitely. I like mean, I nine, got you yeah. to stay till yeah. like eight, or nine. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, this dude was filming us playing PlayStation with a generator on. I'm just like, dude, the generator's on. Like, isn't that fucking up your like professional audio? I'm gonna get demo actually while. I'm I want to find those uh, little throwing. Yeah, yeah. But he was he, he stayed with us so late, and I was like, I need to go to bed like now. now yeah. Uh, now specifically, just because I don't just want you here we anymore. Leave, <laughs> we yeah. kind of rushed him out. Uh, but here's one. Uh, I think I had two of these. Uh, wouldn't that be crazy if one of them was still left in Damien's face? <laughs> as long as I have one, I don't want to end up stepping on it. This dude, I was. But the thing is, he knows I'm out here. He knows where the RV is exactly. He has the exact location. I was a fucking idiot to get. I don't know why I trusted him. I think I was, I was in the emails. I more trusted what he stood for, like the opportunity that he presented. I was like, like my eyes lit up, and I was like, "Yo, more exposure for the channel." I was like, "Dude, that's awesome." Um, unfortunately, I think it was all bullshit. So I don't know if he's back to Cali, but I gave him my number. Uh, late before he left and I was like hey dude you know let me know when the video goes up I want to check it out and uh, I told him I was like you know what you, you flew all the way out here maybe I'll give you a shout out you know I've given shout outs for a lot less so mm -hmm. so he's got my number which sucks but he knows where this is and that's the big thing you know, he, was, he was asking he's like you can get your dad out here yeah and I was like dude I fucking ran away from my dad you ignorant bastard like why do you want my no so that to me it was like what's what the hell is happening here? Um, that when I remember when I offered him those Doritos and he took them, he never even ate one. Did he open them? What kind of man doesn't eat Doritos? Right? I'll give baby food. I'll give you that. But 
So yeah, I want to move the RV, so I'm gonna have to talk to Uncle Larry. Not only that, but some people in the comments have figured out where we're at. And, uh, okay. You know, God forbid they somehow alert my dad, and you know we got fucking World War Three out here. If only it was a little bit smaller, that'd be so sick. Would be. Uh, yeah. Torrential downpour, yet again. It sucks. All day inside. Uh, super bored. Today. You gonna sleep over tonight? Is this the night, dude? Weekend? Is this the night? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> right. Maybe, uh, you know what? Fuck you, dude. Maybe I'll just like go to Juliet's or something. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea, so you're not coming to the RV anymore? You are something else. I'm hungry. Dude, I'll, and, and not only that, I was gonna have Juliet come out here, you know, a little camping trip, but, mm. uh, shit. I still got, I still got three in that one. <sighs> Sorry guys for just one upload yesterday, but that dude, he stayed with us for all of like, what was that, eight hours, nine hours? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, so we didn't have much time. And also, you know, we're dealing with not the best of internets. So uh, we're sorry about that. Try and get two out to you today. Yeah, go to Juliet's and actually get a real meal. Probably her treat, but hey, I no shame in that. <laughs> Hi. Hey, uh, what are you doing this weekend? Um, I have like some rehearsals and stuff, but. Are you? I have to be here, but like other than that, why? Nothing. Why? Could I come then this weekend, or 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 maybe you come here in the RV? <sighs> oh, I want to see you, but I I mean I can't come there because I have like different things I've heard so bad. And, I mean, you, well, yeah, you know, you don't have to worry about my dad. My dad, I'm I'm an independent man now. You can come into the RV and we can have alone time. There's a tent. It's, it's wet out here, but... Yeah, it's so rainy. It's been raining all week. We could just be in the RV then. I mean... I will. I will eventually, but I can't this weekend. That's great that, like, you have your own kind of space, though. So, okay, but I could come see you? Is that a good idea? What, you mean just because of my dad? Yeah. He doesn't know. He doesn't know where I am. He won't even know that I'm coming to see you. And that was never a stipulation. You couldn't come. I could still see you. That's true. That's true. Right. I don't. Uh, I don't want to be a burden though. I'm just like it's starting to get lonely out here. Uh, Corn doesn't fucking no, sleep you can over. Come. You can come here. I, yeah. I won't be back till like late tonight. But could I come late tonight? Want to, yes. Is that funny? Yeah. Is that funny? It's just cute. I, yeah, I want to see you. Yeah. That works. Yeah, and then what? You would leave Sunday? Yeah, I guess. I don't want to. You know, I know your semester's ending. I don't want to get in your roommate's hair or whatever. Yeah. A lot of events this weekend, but mm -hmm. I mean, if you're cool, it's a long time and we're like, yeah, well, with me, but... yeah, no, I'd come with you. I need to be busy right now. I just, I'm still, I'm still, you know, we've talked before yeah. this, but so I was just with the room destroyed and I know, I know, out. that was that. We had a lot of good times there, yeah. Getaway place, you know. Yeah. But now you have the RV, right? That's right. Yeah. Who needs a room when you have a whole moving house? Moving house. So you're gonna take the RV and come here? No. <laughs> no. No. Okay. No. <laughs> I mean that could be cool. I, mean, I don't know where you would park that thing. <laughs> I do need to, I do need to move it though. I had this this strange guy. I took this opportunity. I thought he, I was gonna get some exposure for the channel. He was doing this doc segment, and he just like followed me around at at the campsite here. And I was like, what the fuck? 
So I want I do need to move it. But not wait, to you not to no. I'll text you don't know where I'm at. I'll text you where I'm at. I don't want anybody to find out cuz they could tell my dad. Oh. I'm saying you could move it. Oh, I'm move sure. it there. Oh, oh, that's what you're saying. Oh, move it to the old campground. Yeah. That actually, that's far away. That's that's not a bad idea. And it'd be close to the beach. Hey, I was just thinking last year when, when you came into the tent with me. That was just, yeah. See, wasn't that fun? You can come out to the RV. That yeah, was fun. See, I gotta, uh, I gotta keep you, uh... that generator, too. <laughs> yeah, well... I had Uncle Larry move it for me. It's it's actually powering this Aww. RV. Oh, that's good. So I gotta keep you. I gotta keep you uh, happy, so you'll come see me. I know circumstances aren't ideal, but yeah, yeah, but I'm not. I do miss you. It's been a while. I'd like you to come. Yeah. Shit don't get easier. I'm just counting down the days till I get my uh, YouTube paycheck in a month, and then maybe I'll was, I'll was think about getting an apartment. I know you'll be fresh yeah. graduated. I don't know if you'd be about that life, but I'd be about that life. I know Corn ain't about I mean, that life. He's a little puss. Maybe she's not little... right away because I don't have a, I don't have a job yet. But... All right, wait, well, come crash when I get one. Aww. So I'll come late tonight. Good. Yeah, I'll see you tonight. Yeah. Cool. All right, you set up a bed for me. Uh, I guess so. <laughs> Excellent. You can't lift that shit. Nah, still have spleeny. Sorry, like doing anything today? What the fuck is there even to do, man? We've we've done everything there is in this RV. I'm just chilling. Well, we can always play PS4. We haven't beat Last of Us yet. No. We did that all last night. I'm just, no. I'm. I don't want to play. I mean, I do want to play. But we just can't. I need to conserve the gas in the generator. I don't want to have to keep spending money to have the liberty to play which is ridiculous to even say I can't even fucking play video games anymore which thinking about that thinking a lot about everything it's just I'm wondering you know how much am I going to take until I just start to fucking break. I already feel like I'm I'm losing it in here. I mean like I fucking cut out Damien's face and put him on Emma's head. I mean I'm talking about two made up spirits, like what the fuck even is that? I just wanna be able to play. I just want to play games and not have to worry about running out of juice to fucking play. I don't want to have a guilt or a shame from playing something that should bring me happiness and fucking... I should be having fun. I shouldn't be having to deal with this sort of shit at this age in my life. I'm 23 years old, dude. That's young. That's called I should be having the time of my life, but here I am in a fucking trailer. Just cause my dad destroyed my room. He destroyed my whole goddamn room with me inside. And I just I let him do it. I can yell, I can bitch and moan. And destroy some shit of his all I want. But it'll... It'll never translate. It'll never matter. And then here I am, running and hiding. Oh no, you know. This weird, creepy man, Brian. What if he goes and tells my dad that I'm here? 
I can't even do my fucking YouTube videos here because then I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I'm afraid that somebody could tell my dad that I'm here and then and then I'm 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 back his. I, I am back to being his slave, force me to do a job that I don't want to do, destroy something that I loved, and that I he let me build in that fucking building. Take my 30 grand, destroy consoles over and over again till I crack. I don't I don't no anymore. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. Why am I so afraid of of my own father? You know, things weren't always this bad. I just remember back just like so many times. I kind of had that same feeling when I was working at the farm where it was like I'm just, I get this point, I'm not happy. Like, I could play a game, careless, eating fucking Doritos, drinking Mountain Dew, and just playing, like, Left 4 Dead and Halo, and enjoying my time with my friends. But nowadays, it's just, you gotta grow up, right? That's what I've been told always, you gotta grow up. I like to think I am. I think that's maybe still one of those things that I convince myself that I'm grown up, but I, I don't feel it. I feel like I don't want to do that because every grown up that I've ever seen isn't happy. You know, they're married to someone they don't actually love or they're doing a job that they don't actually enjoy. And then they think back to their childhood, back to when they were happy and they're not. But mine, my childhood, I don't want to let go of. I don't want to give up these things that I love so much just because I have somebody in my life that didn't get it. Or even other people too. I don't. I'm sick of the pressure to do all this shit that I don't... I don't want to be, man. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. I can't even just... I can't play. I can't do anything. There's nothing to do here. And it's all... God, I miss that room. I miss so much. And I miss the people in my life that actually did support me. Like my mom, my fucking dad, and I'm, I'm thinking about the future. You know, how long am I gonna be in here? What am, what are my plans? And then I said I wanted to wait till my next paycheck from YouTube in May, and you know, in a few weeks, and then I'd get an apartment. But then it's like, and then that's it, and then that's it, right? My dad just gets away with it. No. I don't want him to get away with it. He took 30 grand from me. You don't just let that go much as I want to go, I just can't let him do that to me. I'm not done with him. I'm hiding now just until I'm going to have to go back to the house to get my things and to have him do all this shit to me over my whole entire fucking life. I'm not just gonna let him get away. <laughs> he wants me to stop doing the gaming and the videos. I'm not gonna stop. And he's just gonna have to deal with it. Can't change your dad. 
<sighs> Future. Where am I gonna live? That's a fucking hard question to answer. I, I'm, I'm at least lucky enough to know what I want to do. So where do I go? Is the Juliet gonna join me or? And where do I? Where do we go with the RV? That's another question. So I don't. We can't stay here, like I said. I mean, if you don't have any other place but the RV, you can just like stay at my house till you get your uh, YouTube paycheck. No. I don't. I did that last year, and then you know Jeffrey came, and I don't want to get you involved. I don't want to get your family involved. Just like I want to get. I don't want to get anyone involved in this shit. I can handle it. Okay, I don't need you. I don't need your help. Oh, I'll, I'll figure something out. I've managed, That's, but yeah, thanks for the offer. Huh? So I think this RV is good. I yeah, I like. I do like the idea of having my own place. I like this. It's just I wish there was more things to do. I wish I had an unlimited generator, or this just had electricity, or if we were actually able to plug. A huge extension cord into this from the house. I don't know. I don't know, man. But thanks, future. At least I'm kind of excited for it. <sighs> Got VidCon and moving out for goodsies. I guess just gotta make the most of what I have now and. I just need to keep what matters close and that's that's always been the juggies and we're closing on three mil I mean that's that's something to look forward to get in the same place I got a million I think that's awesome I thought about with my dad I was saying I haven't given up it'd just be what if I did like some kind of montage again for three mil to show them how much it matters. Something. We gotta do something. Alright. I just rambled. Oh, I, got an, I had gotten a text from uh, Georgie. He, uh... He says he wants us to come over tonight. Mm -hmm. So... He said he had this, uh... This old video... Of me. Like, old... Like ten over ten years ago, <laughs> so I want to check it out. So you know, we can swing by. <laughs> um, I guess that's something to do. All right, Jace, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Twitter, Instagram, links in the description. Sorry if I was just like going off there. It's just there's nothing to do, and it's just making me think. God, you fucking messed that room. You know what? Screw it. Let's drain the generator. Let's fucking juice that thing. Bone dry! We gotta beat this game. Or hell, we just gotta get past that fucking spot yeah. with the <laughs> zombies. Alright, Jays. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Love you, Jays. Death. You wanna enjoy that this weekend? Don't forget to keep it rigid. Alrighty. Oh, gotta turn it on first. You wanna start it for me? <laughs> <laughs> sure.